All right, y'all, let's talk about Kanye West. Now, before his debut 2003 album, College Dropout, Kanye was producing hits like Talib Kweli's Get By and Scarface's Guess Who's Back. Now, the scene is 2001-2002. Kanye's collaborating with an artist, a producer, that signed his first major label record contract as a vocal artist. The working title of that album, Pay J. And the artist in question, Jay Dilla. But that album wasn't released until 14 years later as The Diary without Kanye's beat. Now, there's a good reason for that, because in 2001, that beat ended up on a different album by a completely different artist. The Takeover by Jay-Z on the Blueprint album. Now, but lucky enough for Dilla fans, in 2016, a 12-inch showed up that was pressed, but only a thousand copies. This 12-inch was called The Middle Finger. It featured two songs that were salvaged from the original Pay J album. The first song, The Anthem, produced by... Hot. All right, y'all. Till next time. Peace. Dilla dog in hell. Set it off in hell.